The great thing about being in Las Vegas is that we have a number of international patients that visit here. So I get to interact with a lot of different cultural identities, ethnicities. Um, and I think that once you've decided to come here, uh, the basic first step is making that call in order to schedule a consultation. Uh, the initial consultation uh, if you're from out of the country, is done over the phone. If you are here, it will be done here at Red Rock Fertility Center. Um, we do the initial assessment to see what studies you've had done, if any, already, and then uh, start the process of the diagnostic evaluation. And what the diagnostic evaluation usually consists of are things like an ultrasound in order to count how many eggs are on the ovary um, for the female. Also assessment of the anatomy to see if your uterus will hold a baby or not. And the fallopian tubes. Because what I'm trying to determine with all of these tests is whether or not you will be successful at not only conceiving, but carrying a pregnancy through to term. Um, once these tests have been completed, and it takes approximately four to six weeks for the testing process to come to completion, then a follow-up visit is scheduled with me where I go over all of your individual results and give you my conclusion, my opinion, opinion on which therapies you would be a good candidate for. Now, I am not the type of physician that uh, only tells you one way to go. If I tell you you only need to do IVF, that's because that is the only procedure that would be successful for you. What I usually do is give you various different options and their success rates, and then you have to make the final decision on which way you would like to proceed. Um, I do not dictate that, that to my patients. I want you, again, to feel comfortable with your decision and know all of the medical knowledge that is going into making that decision so that you will come to the right decision for yourself and for your family in how to proceed with fertility therapy.